Rose fam, welcome back. I'm so glad you guys clicked on another video. We got a lot going on today. I am going to be changing my stove top to a brand new one. I'm going to be sharing with you my own personal copyrighted fruit salad recipe as well as you guys I have some information to share with you guys that you do not want to miss people are getting away with some things that they should not be getting away with so make sure that you tune in to the entire video so that you are kept in the loop of what's going on but anyway i hope everybody is doing amazing you guys i tried to hold off what happened was when we closed on our home this obviously all the appliances uh were brand new um, but this had a scratch on it so the project manager did not want us closing with a scratch on our stove so what he did was order us a brand new one and when they came to um, give us the brand new one the gentlemen that came were so so sweet they said hey look we're replacing the stove but we're gonna throw the one out that you have so would you like to keep the extra set of you know the grill the eyes all of those and I'm like oh yeah I definitely would so I have been holding off um, using them I've just been cleaning them and to be quite honest I'm gonna keep the old ones and give them a real good cleaning but for now I just wanted a brand new stove top so here I'm gonna go ahead and get it scrubbed down really really good and then you will see me begin to put the new pieces of the stove together just wanted to extend a huge welcome if you are new to the Rose fam. On this channel you will find lifestyle, home decor, shopping, try on hauls, anything to do with lifestyle you'll find it here on this channel and I also love to share cooking and recipes. So if that sounds like something that you're interested in please don't leave without hitting that red subscribe button and for all my existing Rose fam this goes for you as well. If you are not receiving the notifications unselect notifications and reselect and make sure it says all so that you guys are notified when I upload a new video. Video. And all the new ones, welcome to the Rose Fam. When I was taking off the knobs, there were these really gross black rings. They still even had some plastic on it. So I just took those off to give it a really good cleaning. And I'm also gonna be cleaning underneath the knobs. That is a place where it really can get so much buildup and we don't take it off very often. So if you have that type of a stove where you can remove the knobs, make a habit of maybe every six months removing it because there is grease and grime that can get stuck underneath there. All right, fam, here is my brand new stove top. It does include brand new eyes and new grill 
top I'm so excited I just love things that look fresh and clean so I'm gonna go ahead and get this unpacked now that the stove is all nice and clean and then we'll get it put right back on the stove So as I said before, I am going to be keeping the old hardware, so I'm going to get it put back into the box. And on the top of the box, I did write down that I needed to clean it. And once I get a chance, I am definitely going to spray some oven cleaner on it, let it sit, and get it as new as possible, just so I'll always have a backup. guys this grill is so heavy and such good quality and it literally warmed my heart to be opening it and just having a fresh start Now that the, the knobs are all clean and the base, I'm going to go ahead and reinstall the knobs. Take a 
flower selection is so beautiful. Oh my goodness. So as you can see, I'm back. Hubby's at work. And I had to get a couple things from the store. So I drove down to the New Smiths. So I can get a little gander. Um, actually, I'm hoping they have some new store opening prices. Um, I do need some peppers. That's what I'm hoping. Everything looks very fresh and whatnot. Two for four for the strawberries. Mm. Oh, look at these strawberries. This looks so good. You guys, two for four. Definitely getting strawberries. But I don't see, I don't quite, oh, here we go. Oh, oh yeah, no. Um, I might have to get two of the Asian. Because it's, yeah, to eat, love the salad, so. probably can't hear me but the freshness of the fruit here inspires me to get it like we eat fruit but I don't like the way it looks and this fruit here is so so fresh looking um, I've never had these and I've never actually seen these so let me know in the comments below if you guys have tried it it said a sweet crisp miniature apple so let me know if you guys have seen it before, if you tried it. I want to make like a nice little fruit salad to kind of snack on. Not a huge one because I don't want it to go bad, but just a nice little fruit salad. Um, I don't know if the mandarins are going to be sweet enough. So I've got strawberries, I have apples, I do need some citrus. So I was kind of looking for clementines, but I might have to do the mandarin. I have peaches, but I'm not really into peaches right now. You guys, this store is absolutely amazing. This was just a regular supermarket, y'all. Just groceries. And they have expanded. There's kids' clothes. You got car seats, children's toys. And coming up in just a second, guys, you will see what they call the piece de resistance. They have a whole clothing section with a dressing room y'all i was 
blown away. pictures in we be writing scriptures right 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 <laughs> you know yeah uh, we was in the heights og tried to sell me cardi is with my crown we some kings like a card in solitaire sticking to the script that's what got us here if you in the way we stepping down like a barber chair we was all downstairs molly vibes till the smoke was clear nephew came in told him boy yo go upstairs this is for the kids yeah cover is had to put in order all of my fears now when i step out i'll be well prepared. yo pop out anywhere yeah we was never scared yeah we was everywhere yeah but you was never there people love to compare but we just never cared we just always did our thing every year we took the stairs back when dylan ain't have a bed we will always volunteer now we young pioneers you so too. Voila! Okay, so we always, I always do grocery hauls on here, so I think I'll just kind of let you guys see what I unpack, and then if there's something new, which we did get some new items that I was really happy to get. I showed you guys we went to the new Smith, so of course everything's fresh and stock there. So, um, but I'm gonna play some music. And when I want to tell you something about an item, I'll come back on. Otherwise, you'll just see me unpacking, okay? taste these i'm gonna open these up i'm gonna tell you guys how these taste i'm so excited for these let me show you up close just in case
this is so good, so sweet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So good. So I love apples, but not the peels. So when I make my salad, I'm gonna peel the peel off of it. These are so good, guys. You guys, hmm, sorry, I'm putting this on camera because I'm probably going to go back up to the store and show them, but these are supposed to be a 10 pack and you guys, there's eight packs in here. Let me count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's crazy, guys. You know what? I think that's been happening a lot. But see, there's nothing in here. Nothing fell out. Nothing. So I'm probably going to um, just show this portion of that to the management so that they know what's happening. What is going on these days, you guys? Let's open this other one up. Hold on. Let me open it. Eight again, you guys. You guys just saw me open it, and there's eight again, and it's supposed to be ten packs. I'm about to write these people, too. That's four packs. These things are seven dollars a box. Check your stuff, guys. It's getting... I told hubby... I was so irritated with how much things cost right now. And then they're cheating us as well. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. But I'm glad I opened it on video. You guys saw it. You see nothing else around. There's eight. There's eight. And there's a 10 pack there supposed to be. And a 10 pack there. So four total is missing. They have a get in touch 800 number. Oh, I'm going to be getting in touch. I never counted them before, but I always was like, mm, did I really eat? Now it's on camera, y'all. Check your stuff, even if it's in a bag. They've been doing that with chips. And now I see they've been doing that with these cookies. All right, fam. I'm still putting these groceries away. I'm almost done, but this is the other thing that I found that I was kind of excited to try. It's a Mary Crunch granola. I love granola, and it has, um, I don't know if it says the kind of berry. Sunflower seeds, cranberries, um, blueberries, almonds, cashews, walnuts. So, let's open this. Y'all, it's a yes for the strawberries. I don't know. That's probably why the food didn't get put away because I've been eating all of the taste testing. Um, 
No, but you guys know I already told you a billion times. It's a lot when you have to put them in certain places. Okay, so. Excuse my nails. I took them off because it's time for a new set. But that's what it looks like here. All right. Mm. 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 You guys, this was a great, successful, more healthy ish haul. This is what it looks like. Take a screenshot, see if you can find that. Now it's in our Smith, and our Smith is has Kroger products. So maybe you can find it there if you have like a Kroger store. But oh my gosh. All right, y'all, let me get finished. All right, y'all. I am done. I have put most everything away. I found this. I'll eat this for dinner. It was one of their little reduced. Maybe about 10 shrimp in here. So I'm gonna eat that for dinner. Um, so pants restocked. It's all this little personal watermelon. Uh, I wanna cut up with that, the oranges. Um, the strawberries look so good. I showed you those in the store. So I got two packs of those and these apples. So I'll be making a little fruit salad but here's how everything looks all stocked up. Oh, shoot. <laughs> I got to get on my little step stool and put that away now. All right. Anyway, everything's fully stocked, as you can see. Y'all, they did it to me. They did it to me with the chips. And it's, it's, it's crazy. The first one with the cookies was ridiculous. Charging people and literally cheating them out of what? they're paying for but the chips they did that to me before but like I don't hadn't made a big stink about it but when you pick the variety you know pack of the chips sometimes at least for us we don't like all of the chips that are in there so we may like the majority and then you know we'll leave it here because maybe the boys maybe Kenny someone comes and they like them I've given some to my neighbor before um so uh anyway so I grabbed one uh and the two that I grabbed it for they didn't have it in the box so what they did was so one of them had three of one flavor that that I was looking for because I think it was like an 18 pack three of one flavor and four of the other flavor the other two was okay one you know it would just sit there but anyway I say that to say neither one of the they had one of each of those flavors and then the rest they just filled up with crunchy cheese doodles but yet the box labels that it has four of one kind three of another two of another three of another it labels specifically what's in the box and you're not getting they're just throwing in there whatever they have well that's not what i paid for i paid for x amount of this flavor x amount of that flavor x amount of this flavor which is why i chose a variety pack and this is what they're doing guys and this is crazy and you know it may sound silly but it's really just a principle it's like you just don't do that to people and they're getting away with it so tomorrow morning trust i will be calling famous amos and walmart because i have it on tape about they they lose mm -mm, we're not doing that anyway guys i'm going to relax release regroup i'm going to take me an amazing amazing shower put me on some noities I kind of want to eat my shrimp before I not it's not like I wear it but I'll be liking to eat, eat that kind of food and then shower but I was out in Walmart so I don't want to eat like this so I'm not Walmart Smith so I'm gonna shower um 
eat and relax and i will see you beautiful queens and kings later all right y'all bye yeah ever don't all right, we are at the part of the video where I will be sharing with you my own recipe for fruit salad. It is a copywritten recipe, guys, so be sure and make it and try it. Just don't market it as your own and stay out the hot seat. <laughs> anyway it is absolutely amazing if you guys didn't know I am planning on doing an upcoming cookbook so I will advise you which recipes are copywritten and which ones are not I definitely want you to try everything and let me know what you guys think but there will be a lot of wonderful recipes um, that I have created that will be in an upcoming um, cookbook I'm not sure when it was definitely my husband's idea and hey it's a great one so look out for that maybe in 2023 I'll have that all put together and ready but in the meantime that's not going to stop me from sharing some things with you guys I won't share all but I will share some and I'll definitely advise you when it's copywritten you got my temperature rising No one like you, boo no one like you. Always keep it hondo when you move They don't really want it with our crew Don't need that drama, she calling your mama Ooh, put out on the move We rolling with the baddest, we can't lose Party till the morning, how we do Just had to feel on your body, girl, you so addicted She got that tsunami when you day with me, can't be still Don't you hurt nobody You be alone if looks can't kill Hey, for don't say, for bougie Girl, you got the whole town screaming Hey, for don't say, for bougie Girl, you got the whole town screaming Hey, for don't say, for bougie Don't say, for bougie Don't say, bougie Girl, you got the whole town screaming
some time Thinking about the day that we met I love to see you smile Can't take my eyes off your silhouette So today I have planned it out so carefully here because my watermelon connoisseurs I don't really eat watermelon anytime I've eaten it it's been in a package but it's not like a fruit that I go get so I see how people cut it in half and they scoop out and they do all of that but logically in my mind it made sense to get real rid of all the peel while it's all whole and then slice it up so don't come for me in the comments so much you don't know how to cut watermelon because i don't but trust this you probably gonna do it this way too so anyway back to the watermelon mm -hmm. preserve you have strawberry pineapple all of those things mango but I use strawberry because strawberry is predominant in our fruit salad you don't have to use a whole lot you saw how much I used and then sprinkle a little bit of lemon juice on top of it I'm telling y'all something that boy I almost can't even eat lunch because I've been eating it <laughs> but trust sit down over some yogurt 
put that in some ice cream too or just eat it just like that that's how i'm gonna do because i don't like fruit in my ice cream but i know some people do and their yogurt but y'all imagine this i'm gonna put y'all on to a real cute dessert imagine okay okay with your what is it greek vanilla yogurt and then top some of this granola right here baby nothing nice nothing nice all right y'all i need to get this stuff cleaned up so i'll be back <laughs> 